Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning everyone. Waalaikumsalam. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning, ma'am. Alright, uh, so I'm going to check your attendance first. Wait. Mm. Ridwan Firman Shah, are you Present, there? Present, ma'am. Yes, I'm here. Alright. Uh, Ilma Nashifa? Ilma, I cannot hear your voice. Can you say check, check to your microphone? Check, check. All right. Uh, Octaviani Nustafi. I'm here, ma'am. Lutfi Andika Burani. Present, ma'am. Hilda Sri Kartika. I'm here, ma'am. All right. Uh, so, do you know, guys, what the materials today? No. Have you read your my syllabus? Oh. No, of course not. No. <laughs> All right. It's okay, guys. Let me mention it. Uh, so, today's material is short story. Mm. Do you guys excited with this material today? Not really, I know. <laughs> All right, uh, so material sure. <laughs> is a short story. I'm going to uh, explain about short story and the uh, PowerPoint. I have shared it in your uh, in our WhatsApp group. Uh, first, the definition of short story. I want to ask to Ilma. Yes, ma'am. What do you know about short story? Short story. Uh... A short story typically takes the form of a brief fictional work, usually written in verse. Great. Textbook, right? It's okay. Uh, so, the short story, there are uh, several definitions about st short story. I will tell you guys. The first definition is, the short story uh, is... A story with a fully developed theme, bit significantly shorter and less elaborate than a novel. So, a short story is a theme that is uh, developed significantly and has less explanation. Actually, uh, yeah, it's uh, the story is similar to a novel, but why uh, is there less a story? Because if, for example, the novel, the author of novels, I mean, uh, build the character of a novel is uh, in a long pages. Do you guys get it? Yes, I All do. Right. Uh, next, uh, uh, guys, have you ever read a short story and you still remember until now? Okay, Ridwan, what short story have you ever read? Uh, what is it? I have no idea. <laughs> you never, you have never read a short story? Mm, what is it? Rarely. So what? What uh, still can you remember in your mind? Uh, what is the title of that short story? Timun Mas. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yes. But I don't. Uh, but I don't really like short story because I think it's too. What is it? A child, a too childish, or yes, kind oh. of that. So I don't like. <laughs> so you like long story, right? No, a uh, kind of novel and others. Yes. Yeah, novel is a long story. Mm -hmm. All right, next. Uh, with, um, elements of short story. First, there are setting. Setting explains the de description of time or place. For example, five years ago, in the middle of nowhere, five years ago is a setting of time, and in the middle of nowhere is setting of place. Uh, next, uh, character. The characters uh, in the short story, even though uh, it is fiction, but it must look real in the eyes of the reader. The writer will give uh, information about the character, for example, Five years ago, in the middle of nowhere, live a very beautiful princess. A very beautiful princess is a character of the short story. Next, uh, 
plot. Number three is plot. This is very important. This plot is a series of events where uh, the author reveals what happened to whom and why it happened and what it is happening in the end. For more details later, I will discuss after I explain this element of story. Uh, next um, point of view is the position where the author will tell the first point of Okay, next uh, point of view. Point of view is uh, the position where the author will tell the first point of view, such as I, me, or third point of view, like he, she, they, them. For example, five years ago in the middle of nowhere lived a very beautiful princess. A very beautiful princess is a uh, third point of view of she. Uh, next, uh, value. This is uh, very, very important. The message that the writer, the writer brings from telling the story. Yeah, for example, uh, like uh, the, the writer made a short story. Well, at the end, what value does uh, he want to share? What value does he want? So that after the reader reads the story, what do they get? And uh, this is, uh, yeah, such, something like that. What's something that we get after uh, we read a short story? All right, I want to ask to someone sleepy out there. Hilda, are you there? Yes, ma'am. Are you sleepy? No. <laughs> no, ma'am. All right, uh, Hilda, have you ever read a short story? Yes, uh, I have read story about uh, the, ele the elephant and friend. All right, what the moral value that you get from that story? I think uh, the moral value that story is uh, if we want to be friends, then just look at the physical because friends come in all shapes and sizes. That's it, man. I think. All right. Yeah, you can say don't judge the book by its cover. Nah, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Like, like, like that. Yeah. All right, next. Uh, now I'm going to uh, to explain about plot. If you look at uh, there, there is a picture of a triangle that is uh, like a mountain. This means uh, the plot. Well, what is the importance of this triangle and why does it make it easier to, for us to analyze the plot? Let's look it together. So this is uh, how when the beginning of the story begins, there must be a beginning, like uh, introduction of the initial character. Where is uh, where is the setting? When and must uh, be, and so on. If in this short story we call it exposition, or you can see uh, in the left side, left left side on the triangle, you, you can see that right. So this is the uh, beginning the beginning of the story. There is uh, after that rising action, like uh, the conflict is uh, rising. Slow, slow down and after that it's uh, getting harder and the conflict that way rise up and up to the peak point which is the peak point well uh, we call the climax so it's like a part of the film like done is uh, the film's a speech we call it a climax climax is where the conflict is so yeah it was so difficult for the character to to spend their life well, after that, uh, there is something called a falling action, where the conflict in the story starts to decline, because there are actions taken by uh, the characters to resolve the conflict, but it's still in the search for a solution. And after that, uh, go to the solution stage, where there is already an action from the search result that is passed in the falling action stage. I think uh, that's, that's enough for the plot. Now, uh, do you guys understand what I explained? From the first until the last, I explained plot. Understand? I do. All right. I have a question, ma'am. So, uh, anyone want to ask something to me? I About want to this ask. Or... Mm. All right, Yulma. Yeah. The uh, question is, is a long story with one conflict 
in it can be categories as a short story man long story with one conflict can be cater categories uh, as a short story all right uh, all right yoma before uh, we we look at the conflict uh, we first we look at the range of words whether it is more <coughs> than 5 15 15,000 words uh, it categorized as a short story, but if it more than 15,000 words, it's not short story. Uh, you can call it, uh, it, it can uh, like a novel maybe, even there is just one conflict inside. Do you get it, Ilma? Oh. Yes, I get it. Thank you, ma'am. Yeah. So if you uh, if you find a long story, even uh, there is a one conflict, but uh, it more than fifteen uh, thousand words, it's not short story. It's long story. <laughs> All right. Next. Uh, anyone want to ask me again? Ma'am. Ma'am. I would like to ask, ma'am. All right, uh, read one. Yes. Uh, my question is, how effective to conducting class or learning something using short story like cartoon, fable, and others, especially in college? Uh, because I think uh, college students do not really like or interesting to watch short story again. And they've already grown up, ma'am. They are not children anymore, of course. I think uh, we approach to matter exactly prefer to serious case uh, for instance, political issues, social and economic, also culture, and it would be more challenging and make us being trained, man. And I think, in my opinion, it it more effective one for college student than a uh, short story. So, how effective of them, of short story? I mean, uh, I know uh, I get it. What did one uh, explain? Like uh, mm -hmm. we have grown up. I mean, you guys have grown up and you don't want to read uh, fables, maybe. You don't want to read Si Kanchil again, right? Yes. But uh, it must be uh, like, yeah, the lecturer will uh, will give you uh, something like this for for like refreshing your brain oh. after in the middle of uh, so many facts that I give to you. You need to refresh your brain, and yeah, I think uh, it's quite effective because short story is fun. Mm. So uh, no one doesn't like short story. I think uh, maybe you don't like a short story. I don't really like, like, but a little bit, like, a little bit. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So the answer is. Uh, uh, we we need to like uh, insert the politic issue, the social mm -hmm. issue, but sometimes we need to. Uh, I mean, our us. I mean, we as a lecturer mm -hmm. need to refresh. Uh, you are your brain. I mean, mm -hmm. in the middle of yeah, so many tasks that I give to you. So it's just for uh, like like uh, something fun, like. Refreshing your brain, yeah. Okay, man. Thank you. But not always. Just uh, sometimes. Okay. Next. You, hey, man. Uh, who are you, Lutfi? Right. Lutfi. All right. Uh, I'm sorry. I get issue with my connection when you do the presentation. Uh, so, as far as I know, that novel is story two, but Short story cannot class classified to novel. So, how to differentiate between short story and novel? Okay, ma'am. That's all. all right. uh, first, uh, in the little thing, you know, why short story name as a short story? You know why? Because the short because the story is short. 
So what's the differentiate between novel and short story? You can see in the little thing like uh, the short story is a short story and the novel is a long story. Uh, like, yeah, for the, the little thing, uh, you can differentiate like that. And in another side, you can uh, like novel is can have many uh, so many conflict inside like more than one conflict so uh, the, the the author like uh, build the character in so many pages there's like in a short story just like in the several sentence uh, they can uh, build the character of the story like uh, for example uh, only the fat caterpillar have you ever heard that story? No? Oh, you never go to elementary school, right? Uh, I mean, uh, for example, in another short story, maybe you can, uh, like, the story is predictable. Oh, the, yeah. the, uh, uh, not, it differs with novel, when where you can uh, find the character of the novel in uh, after so many chapter right have you ever read a novel yes what novel yes. you have read topis verden topis topis world I don't know. all right so uh, what do you think uh, are, uh, is there any some uh, differences between novel and short story that you have read? Yes, yes. Uh, both uh, short story and novel have different things. All right. Yeah, so you can differentiate it by yourself. Yes, yes. Yeah. Uh, so, Thank you, ma'am. All right. Uh, ma'am. Anyone? All right. Okta. May I have a question? No. Uh, of course, yes. Well, how about a story that uh, has uh, like more than one complex, but it's short, like uh, it just 200 words, but it have so many conflicts in it? Uh, I think it categorized as a short story because the length of uh, the words is... Uh, less than 15,000, so it's a short story. Okay, thank you, ma'am. But I think uh, in your story that you that you mean, uh, the, the character is, yeah, I mean, the character is same, like uh, uh, there are no, no more than two character that the, the author build in that story because the story is so short. It's 2,000, uh, 2000 words, right? Yes, no, uh, it just like have just uh, 200 words. Yes, it's short story because uh, this the story is short and I mean, uh, the character of the story just one. Uh, even the conflict uh, is more than one, but uh, the 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 subject, I mean the character of the story is one, right? Yes. If, Thank you, uh, ma'am. There is more than one. That uh, that you can call it compilation of short story. Oh, yeah. I understand. Yeah. Okay. Ma'am. I have a question. Uh, how many, how many kind of short story that can be booked to class? Uh, how many kind of short story? Um, uh, I think you 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 want to ask me how many types of short story, right? No, how many kinds? Like uh, like I have already know four kinds. It myth, legend. Oh, yeah. 
So how many kinds of short story? There are four short story. You have said earlier, it's a myth, legend, fairy tale, and I don't know once when the one, the rest one. Only four. Yeah, but I I know uh, there are ten types of short story. I think uh, you you wanna ask me. Uh, I I hear in your question, like types of short story. Like yeah, there are ten types of short story like anecdote, drabble, fable, fake food, flash fiction, fame story, story sequence sketch story and a fignet have you ever heard about that yes but not all i think yeah, it's so i want to explain one by one hear me hilda okay uh, anecdote an anecdote is a type of storytelling about a real person or incident the short story count of something is interesting as well as amusing. Like a funny story. Have you ever heard anecdote? Anyone here, have you ever heard anecdote? I'm forget. <laughs> like a funny story, right? Ilma, have you ever heard anecdote? Hmm? Yes, ma'am. Have you ever heard anecdote? Anecdote, uh, yes. What is anecdote? What do you know about anecdote? Uh, anecdote. You Maybe. don't really know about anecdote? I forget, yeah. ma'am. All right. Uh, anecdote, like a funny story, right? Uh, in the... Senior high school, maybe. Uh, you have ever uh, learned about it, and then uh, the next one is Drable. The Drable. The purpose of this type of storytelling is briefness, especially short, the consistent uh, one hundred words. Fables, fables. Anyone knows fables? So I want to ask to. Octavia Ninur Sophie, what fables have you ever heard? I mean, have you ever read? Uh, I read about a dog with his shadow, like a short story about. Oh, uh, ma'am, sorry, ma'am. All right, uh, read one. Sorry, uh, because time is almost up. Uh, I mean, time is almost up. Uh, because. We have to come to another class, so I think you can give us the talks about that. Yes. All right. I want to give you a task. Yes. Uh, and I will share the link. Mm -hmm. Because uh, the you. time less than one minute, ma'am. It's okay, Ridan. I will uh, call your okay. lecture, your next lecture after okay. this. Sorry, right, man. Uh, I think uh, I think that's enough for today. Mm -hmm. If there is uh, another question, feel free to ask me in a WhatsApp group. Yeah. Goodbye.